Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jordi and welcome back to Gran Turismo Sport. It's about that time, ladies and gentlemen, to buy another dream car. And uh, you already know what it is. Of course, this is the final dream car that uh, I've noticed in this game that I want to buy. Next episode will be live, so uh, make sure you got your notifications on um, to, um, you know, see the next Gran Turismo stream. Um, so, pretty much, let's get right into the Brand Central and buy this car. Now, this car that we're about to buy uh, has grown on me recently. Um, recently as this year or December. Yeah, December. Not even December. I liked it when I played Need for Speed 2015. But, uh, yeah, you might already know this car. Need for Speed Heat. Um, kind of did this car an injustice uh, by ripping all the customization away from it. But... Obviously, a couple episodes ago with Need for Speed Payback, uh, we were able to see those customizations finally, and it was great. But there is a special version of that particular car in Gran Turismo, and we are about to buy it. I cannot wait. Where is it? Here we go. The Porsche Cayman GT4 Club Sport. Here it is, folks. Wow. Look at this. This, this game looks absolutely beautiful, and I'm playing on, like, the day one edition of the PS4. Like, you know, you can't get any worse than this PS4, and I cannot wait. I cannot wait to get to play this game on the PS4 Pro. But look at this absolutely beautiful car. Obviously, we're going to want to switch the color for it. There's only one color for it right now, unfortunately, but let's go into the studio scenes. Look at this, man. Look at this. And we can go in dynamic scenes. That loads so fast. I love that. Look at that. This car looks great. It's a great looking car. Well, are the, are the rims exactly the same? I don't know. But it, it, it does look absolutely incredible. Look at that. I love the Cayman GT4. It's an amazing car. Unfortunately, we've only got one color for it. Let's use our credits. 300 and 50,000. This is the most expensive car I've bought. It's worth it. I love this car. Here we are. Here we are. <laughs> the Porsche Cayman GT4 Club Sport Edition 2016's Cayman GT4. Of course, we're going to change this car. This is going to be my most used car now. I think this is my favorite car now. I'm really not sure. The Cayman GT4 might just be my favorite car. Uh, at this point in time and it has been for the last few months honestly uh, so first of all we're gonna go into discover and we're gonna search for some liveries we're gonna this is the first time we've actually searched for some liver liveries uh, for any car uh, well at least lie uh, at least in these videos anyway so let's go into uh, I I hate searching for specifics like I really wish it would do it automatically for what car you're using but I mean whatever it is what it is so Let's have a look at these wraps then. Um, like, I want one that would suit the car in a beautiful way. Hmm. I mean, I like the default wrap, but I, you know, I don't like it that much and I want to switch it. And honestly, these ones I don't really like that much neither. And I wish you could uh, filter it to show the most popular ones, but I guess that's not the case. Um, I really don't know which one to go with here. That Twitch one looks pretty nice. I can't lie. Um, I thought that was a Red Bull one then. <laughs> that would have been funny. I don't know what to go with. A lot of them just, they, they don't look appealing to me. I'm not going to, I can't lie. They, they, they're just not appealing. That one though is really nice. That one is really nice. We might go with this one. Yeah, look at that. That looks really nice. I'll give that a like and we'll add that to the collection, of course. Um, so, I obviously want to change the rims, though. Uh, I don't like them being pitch black, uh, so we'll change that. Change car livery. Let's go into my collection. There it is. I've never had a red Porsche Cayman GT4, so we'll do it now. Of course, uh, the one I have in payback is grey. And the one I have in heat is pink, and then the one I have in 2015 is the uh, the flame wrap that uh, Blacklist number 10 had in Most Wanted. 
Although that is subject to change when I go back to it. So I'll probably, I'll probably change it to blue flames. I feel like doing that. This car looks really nice, but I feel like the rims have kind of been ruined. So uh, obviously we will switch that up. Right, friggin now. So we're going to the livery editor, I think it is. Nice. All right, new design. Came in GT4. Let's go. And I'll probably change uh, the thingy suit today. Oh. Oh, God damn it. I don't want a new design. Can I edit one? Open design. Are you kidding me? I can't customize the one I have? That fucking sucks, man. All right, we'll just go for a new design then. Uh, paint won't be included in the design you're working on. No. Uh, can I change the rims? Yes, here we are then. So, uh, we can obviously change the rims, but I love the stock Cayman GT4 rims, obviously. Uh, so, color palette. We will go... I might go with the red. Yeah, we might go with the red. Or not. Maybe we'll just stick with what we have. Metallic. We can go with special... now. Nah. <laughs> yeah, we'll go with metallic silver. We'll stick with that. And... Uh, Save that. New design. Save. Now hopefully that sticks on. Otherwise I'm just going to have a black rims that just don't suit the car. Uh, don't apply livery. Oh yeah, actually. No. Right, is that... Like, it's not a livery, it's the rims, right? Surely it applies? No, it doesn't. Ah. That sucks. Why would you change the rims to black? I don't understand you. Why can't I edit the one I have, you know? I don't understand that. Right, let's look at the car settings. Uh, so, we can power up this. Uh, ooh, we can have some really good power on this. I actually don't have enough mile mileage points for any of this, but we'll put the weight reduction right down. We'll put the power level right up. Um, well, these are racing rims. So this is a completely different car entirely. Nice. So, uh, racing, not racing rooms, racing tires. So we actually get to try something new today. So, arcade, single race. Um, Colorado Springs. I love how you can get off-road things in this game, but I'm not really interested in off-road anyway. Um, not in, uh, at least not in this game. So, is there a German that we've got? <laughs> I was going to say, is there a German track, but there's Nürburgring, and I do not want to try... Nurburgring Goodwood. Oh, this is a British track. Okay, uh, so we'll go in Dawn. I think Dawn would. Dawn is going to be perfect. Garage cars, boom. Or garage cars, garage, garage. It's like the the, the same thing. Automatic. Let's go. Um, should we try experts? Should we try professional? Should we? Should we try it? Let's go. Let's go. Let's try professional. I'm probably going to get my ass beat, but um, we'll see how it goes. Here we are then. Hear the sound. Ooh. Sounds nice. I like it. I do like that a lot. So, um, car settings. I really wish we could upgrade this, but we cannot. I don't have any money. So, um, would the racing soft do any better? Yes, it does. Perfect. So, um... Right, I think that's as much as we can do pretty much. I don't understand the rest of this stuff. Maybe I will one day, but it is what it is. I always put the soft tires on because uh, I never have any penalties on for it. And, uh, you know, it, it's easier driving. Right, here we go. Woo. Excited, here we go. Let's do it. Right, I have not played this game in about a week. And I think it shows already. Right, so we're on professional, the hardest difficulty we can do. Um, and I haven't played anything above intermediate yet. Or whatever it's called. So, uh, we'll probably struggle. But we'll see, we've got three laps of this. Anything can happen. This looks really nice at the front. I forgot to change my driver's suit. I'll do that at some point. We're still in the X-Wing suit. This handles really well though, I can't. Right, can we, can we get an overtake here? And he's going to overtake us back, though. 
What is that in front of them? That's a Citroen? What? That does not look like a Citroen. At all. I've seen a lot of Citroens. This handles really well though. If we were on intermediate, we'd probably be in a better position by now. But who knows? Maybe we could catch up to everybody. We are in almost a completely stock Porsche Cayman, so we'll have to see. We are then. We better hit the second lap, I think. This corner I do not like. But the car handles really. Is that a Veyron? Holy crap! I forgot that was in the game. looking really good though. I really wish the normal Cayman GT4 was in this game, but I mean it is different, so I'll take that any day. But we're about to take over a Veyron in the Porsche Cayman. Goodbye! Let's go. Is that a Hurricane? I think that is. I wonder if the Hurricane... Oh my god! I wonder if the Perfomante is in this game. That'd be cool. But we're actually doing pretty well on Expert. I, I can't lie. Is it called Expert or whatever it is? Oh, we were doing pretty well. It handles so good. Man, the racing cars. I, I've only tried, like, the normal cars at this point. I, re I haven't really tried anything else, you know. I haven't played since the last episode. So, you know. I've been pretty busy, though. Honestly, so... Yeah. Here we go, though. Is that a Pojo? It looks like it. <laughs> I don't know, it kind of reminds me of Pojo. Right, we're getting onto the final lap now. So we really need to start making some overtakes. And oh my god, that car in front of me put me over. Come on, man. I gotta, I gotta make some good overtakes here. Come on. No! God damn it. I'm just not as good at this game as I'd like to be. I have the fastest lap though, apparently, so I'll take that any day. Alright, come on. At least give me a top three. Right, at least we know in future videos I ain't trying expert difficulty, that's for sure. Come on, make this overtake. Come on! Let's go. It's an Audi TT, a Scirocco. I have that Scirocco. I just haven't used it yet. Come on, there's one more overtake. Maybe we can take him. Maybe, but he seems to be rocking. Is that, isn't he in a Megan? There's a Veyron behind us, and he's in a fucking... That's not a Megan. You're, you're kidding. You're joking me right now. You are absolutely kidding me. All right, we'll go into cockpit camera. That is a Megan. What on earth? Talk about sleeper cars. Oh, this sounds really good on the inside. Come on! Push! God damn it! One more lap, one more corner, and we would have had him! God damn it! Wow. See, we overtook him afterwards. I'll take that. First place, we overtook him afterwards. Boom. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, maybe we'll try another race. Yeah, we'll try another race. I wonder if there's like a sprint race or whatever. I actually haven't tried custom race yet, so we'll try that. Let's go custom race. And we'll see what we have. So, um, what track are we going to want to use this time? I want to go in Germany, but... Oh, Spain. Okay, we'll go Spain. Um, let's go in daytime, I think, this time. Yeah, complete daytime. We'll go in the sunset, actually. We were at dawn before, so we'll go sunset. Um, once again, in the Cayman. Right, so this is it. Um, so race type, laps, endurance. Holy crap, time limit 10 minutes, out of here. Ooh. Choose laps to set a number of laps for this. All right, we'll go one lap, I think, yeah, one lap. Number of cars, they can, uh, they can be up to 20. Starting grid. Holy crap, okay, <laughs> we're gonna start from first. Let's go. Um, Start. We'll go grid start. I haven't done a grid start yet. Tire wear off, fuel depletion off. Uh, opponent crack category. Yeah, whatever. 
opponent difficulty. Uh, really don't matter. We'll go professional. God damn it. Um, war collision penalty. Nah, shortcut penalty, none. Flag rules. Wait, shortcut penalty. Nah. Place cars when they leave the track. Automatically returns cars to the course if they go off track. Ah, no, we'll have that off. Ah, fuck your flag rules. Alright, let's start race. Let's go. Custom race for the first time. We're starting from first place. Let's let's do it. This car looks great. This car is great. I'm excited. Alright. Here we go. One lap in the Cayman GT4. Woo! Wow, I liked that. I liked that a lot. Oh, it's the same same opponents as last time because that McGann was in front of us. Here we go then. One lap of this. Let's go in the Cayman. Oh my god, I love this car so much. I'm scared this is not going to be in the next Need for Speed game because the Cayman GTS is out now and the 718. You know, the 718 pretty much. The 718 Cayman GTS and the 718 Cayman GT4 is out now. So there's no... This one's not going to exist anymore. And that's going to hurt because I love this car. And I really want to own one one day. I hope they're still in production uh, when if I'm... If, there's any time I'm able to afford it, which there won't be, but I can have my hopes, I can have my dreams. This is my favorite car right now. Listen to the sound of that, it sounds great. Woo! Break right here. Only one lap of this, I can get behind this. Sick of all the endurance races, sick of them all. I hate them. Though. This car handles really well though. Out of all the cars in this game, this might be my favorite in terms of handling. Uh, so I'm assuming all the racing cars or whatever they're called all handle like that all, all handle like this, which would be great. Oh you cheeky bugger. Get back here, man. How is that Megan so good? There's like there was Huracans and fucking Bugatti Veyrons and everything. Out of all the things to beat that and me. It's a fucking Renault Megane. Are you kidding me? Mad. <laughs> All right, here we go then. About to take the W. Slight setback on that course, but it's all good. Look at this beautiful car. Wow, there it is. The victory right there, just under two minutes. I will take that. We'll take the prize money and the mileage points. Bada bing. Bad at friggin' bulb. Whatever. Right, so now we want to go into the photo mode, of course. As is the tradition every episode. We gotta take a photo of this. Right, so uh, the 2019 selection. Let's go for the editor's choice. Um, oh, half of... Oh my god! Have I still not got... Oh no, this one's where the driver can be placed. Okay, right. So they're not downloadable. And I still need to go through the DLCs for this. Oh, that looks great. Wow. Um, oh, I'm probably going to go with the gas station. Near the Nürburgring. Okay. Uh, I might go with the gas station. We'll see. Let's look through all of them. The pit lane. Volcanoes. San Marco. Liechtenstein, Jesus Christ, Hawaii. Why is this a thing? <laughs> Cleveland National Forest, Tokyo Outer Ring Road, Liberty Bridge. Wow, that looks great. I might go with that, you know. And these are the Scapes content pack, and they're free, so I need to uh, definitely look through at some point, but we'll go with this. Boom. Place new car. You know what we're placing. The Cayman GT4. Yeah. And we'll put that right in the middle. Look at this, man. Headlights. Nah. We don't need them. Detailed settings. Um, key lights. Yeah, we need them on. I think we definitely do need some headlights on. 
Um, I think we can have. I think we can survive with low beam. Yeah, low beam. We'll go with that. Uh, place driver. I ain't gonna do that. Um, that looks brilliant. Look at that, man. Look at that. Let's look at that. Woo that looks great, man. I'm loving this. All right. Um, I do. Lo I love the soundtrack as well. Bleach bypass. Uh, partial coloring. I do want something that brings it out a lot, um, which is none of these. I might still go with the bleach bypass thing. Uh, I don't want the mask. Oh, there it is. And I want it on the background. Boom. I like that a lot. I like that a lot. Oh, and that changes the background. So, hmm, let's see uh, what the best one would be. Monochrome looks great. I've just ruined that. There we go. Oh, I can't look at that. Look at that. That looks nice. I'll screenshot that uh, for a future Instagram post, but that's all that's going to be. Highlight boost. I'm probably just going to go with Bleach Bypass, but the degree of application is going to go down a little bit to allow... For more um, uh, to allow for it to, you know, look a lot less sharp. Um, that looks great. I love that. Um, so I, I think that's what we're going to stick with. Yeah, I think that's what we're sticking with. Um, temperature. Oh Jesus. Okay. Yeah, that's definitely staying as it is. Right. Uh, yeah, I think that's it. Boom! I'll screenshot that. And, um, shoot! There you go! Render that. And, uh, yeah, we'll upload that as well for you guys to like on the socials. That looks great, I love it. Save this photo, hell yeah! Share. My newest favorite car. The Porsche Cayman GT. Porsche Cayman GT. Only this is the 2016 racing edition. There we go. And that is the coolest thing ever. We'll just put a smiley face. Boom! And upload that, you guys can go ahead and like that on the socials. And there you have it, folks. That's the Porsche Cayman GT4 Club Spot. We're going to go back to the main home. Wow, what a car, man. What a car. So, obviously, uh, I do apologize for the lack of uploads recently, but uh, I can't help it, honestly. Really not much going on right now, but there will be. Uh, I'm trying to make myself a schedule heading into the summer holidays, of course. We're officially in the summer holidays right now, but heading into August... That's where uh, things are really going to start changing. It's going to be pretty damn good. But yeah, until the next video, guys, I'm probably going to try and upload twice today. Uh, this is going to be the second upload of the, of the day, if so. Uh, so I'm uploading WW2K16 also. So if you haven't watched that episode and you're interested, go check it out. Uploaded earlier today. Um, but yeah, guys. That was the Porsche Cayman GT4 Club Sport. Next episode of Gran Turismo Sport, we're going to go live. And for people who are still watching at this point, we're going to be collecting all the Dodge Vipers, which I'm really excited for, okay? Because there's three Dodge Vipers in the game, which is pretty cool. You know, there's a lot of cars to collect, but uh, I'm glad to have finally collected all my favorite cars, man. It's so cool. The new Supra. The... 
um, Aston Martin Vantage S and now the Cayman GT4. It's pretty darn cool. I'm loving my car list right now. I can't wait for the next episode. Guys, thank you all so much for watching. If you liked it, hit that like button as high as possible. Can comment, share, and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you all in the next video. Until next time, peace!